In today's episode of Surgeon Shorts, I'm gonna show you how to tie a surgical knot with a one-handed tie. And bonus, if you watch till the end, I'll explain the situations where you might actually have to do one-handed ties and might not even have the option for two-handed ties. It's not what you might think. I'm gonna try to film this film quickly enough so that Gershwin doesn't get excited. Look how good he's being. Okay, let's go. So I think of surgical knots as two motions. This is the forehand, and then this is like the backhand. So the first throw, you tuck your finger in through the loop and pull it down. And then the second throw, you flip it over your hand and pull it down that way. Tuck the finger in and pull it down. Flip your hand around and pull it down. You'll start to see that you are stacking your knots and they lie nice and flat. And here's your bonus. The reason why sometimes you have to do a one-handed knot is when you have to hold tension, like when you're tying a vessel or fascia, and you only have one hand left to actually tie the knot. 